Hey, this is Jenny Jones, Digital Growth Hacks Club. All right, thank you for tuning in. Listen, I want to get straight to it. I have a tool that's just kind of no one's really know about it. Well, some people may know about it, but I think some people who frequent my channel a lot may not know about this tool. If this is your first time to this channel, please go ahead and like, subscribe. I'm always coming up with these different hacks, looking at different tools, trying to reverse engineer them, trying to make them work for us and our business and our bottom line only subscribe if that's what you're looking for. All right, so let's do this. Let's look at a tool that you don't know that you need it, right? And again, whenever I'm bringing you different tools, there's a lot of tools that drop every single week. I'm trying to bring you tools that's going to move the needle in your business. And I think this tool meets the meets that that actual obligation if that's what you're looking for. I'm actually at the same time when I show you this, I'm going to show you another tool that you can actually use if you picked up on any other tools that I was talking about over the last couple of weeks. That's going to be just I'm just going to throw that secret hack in here. Let's go over my desktop. Let's take a look at it. All right, so we're over at my desktop and of course I have YouTube up, but this tool is about YouTube, but it's about another tool as well. And what I want to do is, well, since we're here, I'll just um, show you around a little bit. These are all my channel members. I want to thank them for subscribing to my channel. Um, you guys don't know this, but I do some members only videos here that I actually only have for my members only. Every week I give them different deals of the week that no one's talking about. I don't even discuss here on this channel, but I let them know that I'm looking at different uh, different videos. So it's not the reason why I brought you here. And if you want to join the, the um, want to become a member of the channel, just go here and I actually put up different things for the community inside there as well. And then I have my lives and things like that here as well. But the reason why I brought you here to my channel, and I just kind of want to just show you the reason why is because YouTube it have to, YouTube is a, how do I say it, right? Let me put myself here on camera and let me, let me tell you what's going on here. So what I want to do is I'm going to show you a hack, right? There's ethical hacks to YouTube, right? Because they're so predictable. And what I mean by that, it's not so much that you're looking for, um, ways to, um, get yourself in trouble. There's ways because it's predictable and what they're after. And so, let me just tell you this. If there's over 2 billion login users monthly for uh, uh, YouTube and millions and millions just logging in daily, there's something to be said about that. And one thing that you need to know about YouTube is YouTube is a YouTube is the new cable, right? So remember when all the cable dollars were going into uh, YouTube? I mean, well, all the cable dollars were going to the cable networks. Well, when people are when people started uh, cutting the cord, a lot of people started flocking to the apps, whether it be Netflix or, you know, or Prime or anything like that. But a lot of people flock to YouTube. So YouTube is a mini universe of many channels that you could. It's millions of channels and people just tune into. Well, the biggest driver for all of the channels, whether it be ABC, NBC, CBS, what have you, they're all driven by ads. The largest portion, 80% of the revenues for YouTube come from ads. The largest portion of ads are going to YouTube because it's so easy to get in front of people, right? The tool I'm going to show you is it's going to allow you to, you can go into back end. And the reason why I chose YouTube as a, a medium or inbound medium or organic traffic is because the SEO is so easy, right? It's so easy to develop. So let me get to the tool. I just kind of wanted to just show you uh, what's going on again. I should have been here just letting you guys see all the different members only videos that I do only for members only. You guys will probably never see any of these videos only members. I'm telling people what's going on and I don't even bring that to my main channel. So enough about that, but let me show you the tool and I'm, it's going to make more sense. I only brought you here first is because the reason why YouTube is so powerful is because of the ads. It's going to be more powerful. I think it is the only really viable opportunity for them 
outside of search because people are getting away from search because now they have chat GPT, right? But YouTube is going to be the, the, uh, it's going to carry, uh, YouTube. I mean, it's going to carry Google at the end of the day. So let's go ahead and look at that tool I'm talking about. All right. So let me give you the bonus tool first, right? And it's going to make more sense when I show it to you. Uh, the bonus tool is called Pixo, right? And a lot of people are like, Pixo, what is that all about, right? So there's seven days left for Pixo, right? And it has 16 five star reviews, it has 16 five star reviews for a reason. But it may have reasons in more than what you think. So this is an alternative to Canva, uh, Figma, and Adobe XD. And here's the reason why they give you like five different tools in one, right? So you look at this, you can design your layout or if you're designing an app or what have you, you can do all of that in here, right? And then these are, you can do brainstorming, sketching, right? Document management, design department, and inspiration. All right, so enough about that, right? And this tool, it's a steal, right? 59 bucks, that's all you really need is, is, is one. If you have a small team or it's just you, you can just go with the 59 buck tier one. I'm throwing that in because I wanna show you something. Um, throwing that in here, this is what I designed, right? And I actually ran a test, right? If you've been following me with uh, Remo and I was so excited about Remo, I was telling everybody about Remo, I actually went in here and created a, uh, a Remo floor plan, right? I'm giving this to you. I normally reserve this for my members only, but every now and then as being a, uh, following my channel, make sure you always hit the bell because you never know, you might miss it. This is a Remo uh, floor plan. And you can see here, it actually breaks it out by the levels. It's got conference, right? It's got tables. So you can do all that. So this is a secret hack for Remo. I'm not gonna get into the details of that, I've tested it, right? Um, it's not 100% fail proof. It's probably 89 to 92% fail proof, all right? So don't come back to me saying, oh, Jenny, but I just did some tests for you, right? I did it, I went in, I pulled the template down, pulled some things, went in here, it's tabled. You can do their banners here, the screens, so on and so forth. So if you got Remo, you might wanna look at um, picking up this tool the reason why I want to show you this tool and the reason how it ended up in a YouTube video, because I want to show you this YouTube hack. Well, there's only seven days if you want to get this. But the reason why I wanted to show you that is because when we go back here and then we go back to the actual, uh, let me get back to the actual page here. All right, so the reason why I wanted to do that is because I wanted to bring up a whiteboard, right? So the whiteboard is in, in this actual tool, Pixo, and I wanted to show you, because I normally use a other whiteboard that I was kind of subscribing to, but I found this one that has a whiteboard built inside of it. So I wanted to show you the whiteboard. And now let me give you the play, right? Every time you follow my channel or my members would tell you, a lot of times when I give you tools, I have to give you the play for it, all right? so. All right, so what I wanted to show you was right here is, this is, we'll, we'll do this like this. And again, this is a whiteboard inside Pixel. Listen, they got like seven tools in here. It's crazy. And it, you can uh, design things with AI, crazy, right? So to actually get people into your ecosystem, right? And I teach this a lot of my coaching clients, they already know that, is you gotta either do it through organic, right? Organic or YouTube. I got organic or YouTube because YouTube is my choice for organic traffic, right? And I can probably put another one up here for a blog or something like that. I just think blogs are just a complimentary piece. Piece. I think blogs were once upon a time primary, but I don't know if they're primary as much. Well, a lot of people are just going to video. They don't like to go to blogs anymore and ads. So if you're using, get this, right? And when I show you the tool, it's gonna make so much more sense to you. If you're using YouTube as a choice, right? Which I am as organic traffic, um, I'm using YouTube. You can only get people in your ecosystem using ads or organic traffic, right? Organic can be a, a sub, sub piece of organic is blogs or a sub piece could be where you're doing podcasts or other different things like that, right? So, but the two core pieces is organic or ads, right? 
the people are going to opt in and then from the opt in right from the opt in you take them you know to an upsell into something else and in, in one of your other uh systems back there one of your e other ecosystems this is this this is your standard and i teach this i do have a a mini youtube course um i may put that available if you guys ask for it if you put it in the chat uh below or in the uh comments i'll add the youtube course in there i may even because you guys are members and you guys saw it here i may put a, i may put a discount on that as well back to the course because i actually teaching people how to actually grow their channels so and it's a mini course it's not over blonde it's not um over the top it's really really in, inexpensive so if this is your only way in right organic is what you know but once you dial in the opt-in page and everybody is taking you up on your offer or you have when people are landing there and they're taking up you up on your upsell then that's when you go and you say okay well what happens when i actually do ads and i run ads to my opt-in page right because that's what you want and, and and then running ads to your your opt-in page your opt-in page you have to make enough or your actual whatever it is that you're offering even here on the upsell have to be enough to cover the cost of doing your ads or your ROAS return on ad spend and so that's that's a little bit beyond that but what you can do with this tool is you can go in the back end, right? You can go in the back end of YouTube ads and you could go in and you can pick up your personas on the back end, right? That is so I'm telling you because what you can then do is you can just come back. You'll know if you're going to run ads, to your particular offer, you know what persona you're looking for. You all you have to do is find the channels. You find the channels that people are watching that will be interested in your particular uh, product or service. So if it's a coaching channel, whatever, maybe there's a big coaching channel that everybody watches, right? And then what you do is you just go, you you run you when you put your YouTube ads together. You say, I only want it to play on these particular channels, which these are the largest coaching channels. So you just go into the back end. So let's look at that tool. This is this is the sickest hack, right? So if you have this and the other tools, I am doing a, um, we do have a YouTube. I'll, I'll put the link in the description below because we're going to do a YouTube uh, uh, breakdown for my, um, for my SaaS Saturdays class. So I'm starting to do these SaaS saturday classes like every other saturday i'm trying to bring you these tools that uh that's going to actually take your business to the next level i'm going to break into them, talk with founders we're going to break down the tool um so make sure you get into that i will put a link below to the SaaS saturdays first episode is coming up this saturday you don't want to miss that but that we're gonna we're gonna talk heavily about youtube so if you want to be in the youtube discussion you definitely want to be there I will probably offer in a bonus or something for my YouTube course, my little small mini course. You guys know I do small stuff. All right, so let's take a look at the tool and I'm gonna show you, I'm gonna show you how it works. So here's the actual tool that I'm talking about and it's available here on AppSumo for a limited time. It's only 49 bucks. I think they only have, I think they only have, uh, yeah, they only have two licenses. And again, I always tell you guys, um, this one's going to give you unlimited video searches, unlimited channel searches, unlimited sites, YouTube office hours and video ads, alchemy course, which is very good. By the way, they actually tell you, they show you how to place all your things for YouTube ads. If nothing else, you can get this particular, uh, tool and be able to, um, use it in your agency to teach someone else how to do ads or something like that. This is crazy, right? And so basically what you do is I'm going to show it to you. Um, so you get lifetime access, right? But what it does is it just goes out and it finds the top YouTube, uh, channels. It finds the top YouTube, um, uh, searches on the videos it finds everything so if you're saying hey i want people to 
to get into my coaching program, or I want people to take me up on my new book that I wrote about uh, brain surgery. I don't know. I'm just giving you an example, right? Uh, I got people out there to teach people how to code, right? Um, you know, I got people out there to teach people how to learn about automotives, sales and things of that nature, right? You just go here and you just punch in the keyword and it's going to give you all the channels that are running ads on that particular, um, it's going to tell you what channels are running ads on it. And then what you do is you tell YouTube, I want to run on that channel too. That's the channel I want to run on. And you're going to get a better, you're going to get a better click through ratio by knowing that instead of just going on YouTube ads and saying, Hey, just place me wherever you can. You can actually go in and almost backdoor the system by knowing where to actually place your YouTube ads. So basically what they do, and they're telling you here, you target your display ads, right? They go through and they tell you, and they actually throw in a, um, this design. You can design tools for non-designers. You can put your, you can design tools in there as well. But what you're going to be doing is you're going to, um, optimize YouTube ad placements. You can basically put your, your ads in front of the people that are going to be watching it. I know sounds crazy, but you can actually do that. So let's take a look at the tool. I'm not going to spend a whole lot of time in the back end of the tool. I just kind of wanted to do one quick demo for you for the sake of time. So let's take a look at it. So, so once you get in here, you could, you could do searches by the following. You could do a video search, a channel search, a site search, and you can do keyword ideas, right? This is crazy. And you can do it for YouTube and uh, Google, all right? And then you can do the placement list, banner studio. I'm not going to get in all that. I'm just going to do a, a real quick. And they got a lot of training in here. So if you're trying to become very versed in YouTube ads, which to me, I think YouTube ads, I've always thought this, even when Facebook was hot. I always thought YouTube ads was better because video is, is a lot better. And a lot of people are watching YouTube TV or they're watching YouTube on their TVs with the smart devices. I'm telling you, this is how this is working. This is how this is playing out. All right. So for the immediate future, I think YouTube is still going to be king when it comes to ads, right? So what if I wanted to do something on coaching, right? And I put that in there already. So a keyword on coaching, because if I want to teach my, share my coaching program and want people to be interested in my coaching program, what I'm going to do is I'm going to search here. You have the max results here. You can say, Hey, how many do I want? I want, I just want 10. So the number one search is going to come on Simon, Simon Sinek. If you haven't heard of Simon, Simon is a, he's a deep leader. He's a deep uh, thought leader, right? He does a lot of thought leadership stuff, right? So what you, what you didn't find is just like, okay, so is this a monetized, is it a monetized enable? Yes. So I want to get that particular channel, right? Then here's another little channel, smart Smith leadership, LLC, it's small video, but it still could play right. Courtney L Sanders. She talks about coaching a lot, right? And so that is, and so you find these channels that talk about coaching, right? Because if they're ad enabled, right? If they're monetized, then your ad's going to run over these channels. So if I go to this channel and says, man, I want to know a little bit more about coaching. These are, these are people that may have an interest in your product or service. Then what you do is you go here and you say, you know what? Let me, um, let me select all of these, right? I'm going to select them all, right? And I'm going to add to a list, put them in their coaching list, right? I'm going to add not only that, I'm going to get the links. I have all the links to all the videos, right? I can tell you right now. And what I do is once you get into, once you get into YouTube ads, they'll ask you, Hey, do you want to have your video? Do you know where you want your ad to play? And you says, yeah, I wanted to play over these YouTube channels that I selected. And you copy these in and you just paste them in. I'm telling you, this is, this is crazy, right? And so you look here, you can you can sort it by views. Who's got the most views? Well, this one has the most views, right? Being your own life coach. It's got 3 million views. Do I want to be on that? Is it monetized? Is it my TED Talk? Yeah, I want to be on that, 
right? And so you're going to have, maybe there's lots of engagement on that. Maybe you want to even visit that channel, right? And see what the engagement is and the questions people are asking once they, well, I'm giving you some of my course. All right. So anyway, so that's kind of what you do. And that's just a, that's just a video search, right? But you can search, you can do the same thing for channels, right? You can do the same thing for channels, the same, the same concept, right? Um, and we can go coaching here. I just want to show you this and then I'm going to wrap up this video. I didn't want it to be long. So again, same concept here, right? This video was published in 2015, right? It's not monetized, right? So we only want to look for, uh, monetized, monetized, um, we only want to really look for monetized type of, uh, channels that we can uh, associate ourselves with. So these are the top uh, channels, but the channel may not be monetized. That's why it's easier. It's almost easier to go to video search and you can actually see it. It'll tell you. And it even gives you the video info. You can play the video or you can search the channel and just with that. So there's just different ways and you can use this. You can reverse engineer this to look for the top videos and you find the top videos here. You can say, okay, so what kind of tags are they using? So I want to use those same tags in my video, right? And, or, you know, um, you can just go there and, and get the info, get the video info, right? You can go there, get all the video info from the, from the video. You can do that. It'll tell you, it'll give you the whole, uh, description, gives you the description. It gives you the, um, the caption, right? And you can learn why is this video so popular and then give you the keywords and so on and so forth right there. And so that's the tag, but see the category and what you need to know when you're putting your video. Oh, okay. I'm giving you more of my course. Anyway, if you want to pick up the little course, you can do that. Let's go back. Let's do a recap. So I talked about two tools, right? Talked about Pixo, right? Which Pixo, Pixo is actually sneaky good, right? It's not going to be good right off the bat when you see it, but you can actually AI generate elements, right? Let me show you an AI element that I generated inside of there. I'm going to show you that as well. You only have seven days left to get this, right? I showed you that one and I showed you Tube Sift. Tube Sift is nice. So I'm going to do uh, a review for them as well. Well, let's look at the whiteboard and we talked about the whiteboard here. So let's go back. Look at what I created in here. This tool, right? So I showed you, I showed you the whiteboard. I showed you the in the import of the floor plan for, for, um, for Remo, right? Cause you can save out as a SV SVG file as well. So and it has the layers on it you know, the, uh, the background layer, the table layer, and it has the chairs, it has the banners and it has the ads layers. So you have all those layers and that's what Remo is looking for. And this actually does a good job of that. Where, what did I do with it? All right. So I clicked on this. All right. So I'm waiting for this to load. I don't know where it went. I clicked on it. All right. So, all right. So there it is. So I asked, actually asked the AI prompt in here to create an overhead office space for me. And this is what it came up with. And this is in the same tool, the same pixel tool. So I already showed you again, I can do, I can save things out as a SVG, uh, PDF, um, different types of files. I can even save it out as a, um, as a sketch file, which is the same format that you need to use sketch, which actually uses for a Remo. So a very powerful, sneaky tool. Hopefully you guys liked it. Hey, this has been Jenny Jones, digital growth hacks club. You guys know, I'm always bringing you the juice. This is this tool work. It, if you use this tool correctly, this tool will make its money back in, 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 in zero time flat because it shows you where to place your YouTube ads. And it also, um, you can use it as a hack to try to figure out what are the top videos and try to find those as well. And what is it about those top videos? You mix this in with a maker suite and you mix this in with uh, a Taj, a Taja and a couple other tools. And you got a nice little combo pack here. I go through all of those in my, in my little YouTube mini course. 
I'll put a link in there if you guys want me to. If not, I won't put it in there. I'm already good on that, but I'm I'm not finished with it. I got a, a couple more chapters to do. So if you want to pick that up and if you definitely want to get it early, I'll definitely give you a nice discount on it. And don't forget SAS Saturdays now. So I'm going to have a link for SAS Saturdays. You're going to be able to go and kind of check and see when we're going to do it, what kind of founders are going to stop by and what kind of strategies we're going to talk about. Don't forget, it should be a link in the uh, below. You'll be able to um, go ahead and um, set the reminder for that. Hey, this has been Jenny Jones. You guys have been great. You guys take care. Goodbye for now.